Hey all, this message is going to be for my Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus. I hope you all are well. Taurus, I will be uploading the video on the Evolved Ones, okay? Um, and I'm going to possibly put it um, just below the link. The Evolved Ones is basically um, a reading just about those who are like trying to transform. Not so much about love. I try to stay away from love from that reading. Um, but if it's something there, then I'll... I'll um, speak on it but like i said this message today is going to be for just reading today is going to be for Taurus, sun moon rising and in venus and you know the saying oh i see the king of cups here and the eight of swords here in reverse so this could either be that someone has really found their king and this person or queen that comes around now is just basically like um it's like a wish type of fulfill like you have so much clarity or this person is basically showing you things and giving you feelings and emotions like this person don't have you feeling stuck they don't date did like this individual have you feeling like you can embrace life that's what i'm getting but this could be just your energy of what you want to what, what you want to give like you're tired of meeting people who are like stuck all the damn time like you know and you are that king of cups. It could be that too as well. So you know the disclaimer if the shoe fits, wear that shit. If it doesn't apply, let it fly, okay? And also too, if you would like to give a donation or um, have a reading, the information will be just below the video, okay? So let's get it popping, Taurus. Some, oh, okay, well, what is this resistance about? Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Let's see what's going on here with our full game okay mm, the three of wands the three of wands and the magician so so there's some messages that are coming in um taurus something that you are preparing for you're working with you got all your resources you're working you're manipulating the situation this is a good thing okay here the eight of wands here in reverse is the tone of the reading so why is it what what somebody trying to block communication or stop a or, or have a delay okay so can cancer you could be dealing with the cancer okay so um somebody trying to block you about something uh taurus just three of wands here and the magician and the eight of wands here in reverse. Let me see. Holy Spirit, why is the eight of wands here in reverse? As I split the deck, I've seen, look what came out. The lover's card here and the nine of wands here. Hmm. So Taurus, is it a sense that are you wanting to reach out to someone or someone wants to reach out to you but they're blocked? Like there's a there, there is a delay. In a messaging, something with a message, something with an action, something someone is waiting for something to come through. Let me see the eight of wands here in reverse, the Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in spirit, and in spirit, and in Venus. And I keep seeing the pages of cups, so someone may possibly want to apologize, but don't know how. The devil card here in reverse. I'm hearing like this person is blocked because. Could have been dealing with the Capricorn because this is like devil-like energy. Or you're releasing yourself from this individual because they were devil-like energy. I'm here like I blocked you. Now what? This could very much well also be to um, Taurus that this person is no longer carrying that type of energy anymore. And they want to find a way to reach out and talk to you. But you got them blocked. Or there's delays to where they cannot contact you. What is this three of wands here, Holy Spirit? What is this three of wands here, Holy Spirit? I'm just hearing manipulating a message. I, I don't know. What is this three of wands here, Holy Spirit? For Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus. The Empress card here in reverse. What is this magician card? Why is a magician here? You know, the Empress is all about, you know, that could be like a jealous spirit. Okay, so basically, let me see. What's this magician card here in reverse?
the three of swords here. It's about heartbreak. You basically have blocked a person or you are blocked from an individual. Somebody here is blocked here because someone does not want to re receive messages from an individual. Someone could have once been a wife and no longer is a wife or a girlfriend with the Empress card here in reverse. Um, the Empress card could be also, in reverse could also be about a jealous spirit. Or this could very much be on tours that someone wants to contact you. But the issue is they are not um, on the level that they should be. Does that make any sense? Like here. Okay, so like here you have the Magician card here and the Three of Swords here. Um, I feel like this person did whatever they could do to try to manipulate a heartbreak. I'm also getting a sense too that Taurus that you can be the magician right now. And that um hold on. Yes. Mm-hmm. Okay. So spirit is basically saying here here's the energy. Right now, Taurus, you're doing your thing, okay? This three of wands and the magician card here. You're doing your things. You're finding a way to manipulate things in a sense of you're the magician, okay? What, what as above, so below. You're finding things, okay? So basically, what this what 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 is being said is here is that this person, even though the page of swords is not showing up, but I'm quite sure it will. This person is really watching you and really see how you are evolving. Is what I'm gonna say. Like you are doing better without them. Um, it's sort of like your person is, is, is suffering, I feel like, like from a karmic cycle. Like this individual was the devil. And I'm going to say was, and they more than likely still is. Um, but it's in reverse. So you blocked yourself from talking to the devil. That's what you did, which is, which is them. This person was giving me like as if though they have narcissistic uh, behavior. I feel like with this three of wands here, like this is something that just basically that that just happened. Okay. There, there's heartbreak here. Not too sure if it's a third party situation. This person could have many different dependencies, codependencies in many different ways. Let me see. Yeah, you see how you have the four of coins here in reverse? That's you just releasing this individual. It's like when you was with this person, everything was always set afire, which means like nothing could create. And you're finding yourself ever since you left this individual, you're, you're, you're able to plan. Holy Spirit, what is this eight of wands here in reverse? So you, yeah, you basically blocked yourself from talking to the devil. That's what I'm getting. What is this eight of wands here in reverse and the devil card in reverse? The Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus, please clarify spirit. The queen of coins here. Yeah, and see, this is you. This is your stability here. That's what you did. And I'm going to tell you, even though you have the three of wands here, you're going to start seeing your money come through Taurus. This king or queen, male or female, you're going to start moving your... Okay, yeah. You basically just blocked yourself from the devil. Holy Spirit, what is the Empress card here in reverse? Why is the Empress card here in reverse in the Three of Wands here? The Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus. The Empress card in reverse in the Three of Wands here. The Four of Cups, okay? is is in reverse because with that Four of Cups... You're not trying to give your cup to that individual anymore. And when I look at this, and I'm telling you, this person has all type of addiction. So for some of you, this could be drug related. Um, just many, they, they had unhealthy habits and that's why you released them. What, what is the three of swords here and the magician card here? Holy Spirit, please clarify. The three of swords here and the magician card here. Three of swords and the magician card here, Holy Spirit. The Knight of Swords. You see what I'm saying? 
this person wants to communicate. This person wants to communicate, but but you will not let this devil back in. I don't think you will. I, I, I'm not. I'm sensing that you won't. Holy Spirit, what other messages do you have here for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus? Yep, the Six of Cups in reverse. You're move. You're trying to move on from this situation. Here you have the four of swords here. You took a break from that situation, okay? And that person is like, damn, this person did not le learn their lesson. You see the judgment card here in reverse? They didn't learn their lesson. So even if they do communicate with you, you're going to stay blocked. You're going to stay blocked regardless of what. Let me see. Yep, see the emperor card? This person is very unstable. The star card, yep. This person has a lot of healing that they need to absolutely and you're moving forward you see with this five of coins here in reverse this is a new beginning for you okay so this is why this person this person does want to contact you or does want and they do want to reach out um to you but this person has heavy addiction problems like seriously and you never thought that you would get to a point to where you would feel okay about leaving this situation but some of you who haven't done this yet, you will. It's going to get to a point, I mean, look, it's going to get to the point where it's going to get so hot where you are with that individual. It's like, damn, nothing, everything is going to burn down. I mean, it's like the queen of coins here. This is who you are in the midst of this. When you have them blocked and delayed, they don't know how to, they, they don't know how to infiltrate you anymore because what they did was some fucked up shit. And you got that four of, I think, I, what was it? Was it the four of cups here? Yeah, the four of cups here now. You're not trying to get, you You don't even want to take their offering anymore. Is what I'm getting here. Mm, let's see. Holy Spirit. Regarding Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What's the outcome? Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Yeah, this person hasn't healed. You can't. The outcome is that you're going to have the Ace of Cups here. Look at here, the Ace of Cups here and the Ten of Swords. Okay? Just learning your lesson and healing from this individual. Okay? It's going to take strength. What's the outcome? What other messages here for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? The Seven of Cups. You have better options. And this person, look, and the Knight of Wands here. You have better options. And also, too, to just know, Spirit want me to tell you, yep, look, if you take this person back, you're going to be crying abundantly. Because, look, even though you have a... Okay, so there's two messages I'm getting here. Seven of Cups. You have a lot of options, okay? Spirit wants you to wait, well, you know, to pace yourself. And you do not have to respond to this individual. And I'm also getting to with this person's energy is that if you let them back in, you will be an option and they will ghost you. Okay. And you'll be back to this energy again. Okay. That's what I'm saying. Damn, damn, damn. I don't have my other cards here. Let's just see. What is this person thinking about? Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What are they thinking? It's deceitful energy, Holy Spirit. It's three cards. What is this person thinking? Three cards, Spirit. Trust issues because they know you can't trust them. They already know. I get jealous. And this separation is killing me. Here's the thing. They get jealous and they and, and they know you have trust issues. But then they, they out here doing everything unknown to God. And they got the nerve to say I get jealous. And this separation is killing me. Well, if you didn't do the shit that you did maybe things will come through for you. 
Let me see what this uh, angel romance, what spirit wants me to tell you, Taurus. Three cards, Holy Spirit. Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus. What should they look forward to, Spirit? What messages and love you want to give them? Finances and career. Financial issues are a factor in your in your love life right now. Okay. So this person, like I said, they could have gambling addiction, just like, and this is why once you had blocked the devil, okay, you notice how you came up as the queen of coins. You blocked them, okay? And two more. Codependency. Addictions are affecting your romantic life. Yep. Yes, ma'am. Attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. Okay, so what well, so what does that mean? You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. It means you attract what it is it is that you want to love. So you need to be mindful in this space of new newness and freeness that you're in. Be mindful that you don't go and attract this energy again. Where is it? This one. You released it. But just be mindful so that you don't attract this again. Okay? So with that being said, I am K-Star Moon Life After. Like, share, comment down below. And I will see you next time, Taurus. Bye.